Hello and welcome back to another video. This problem, we're given the graph of a certain equation, and we want to connect it to which one of these options it could be. So this information right here, these factors that are all multiplied by each other, these are going to represent the zeros of this function. So if we look at this, we have y equals, and then if there's going to be a factor in front, it's all one-fourth, so we can assume that that's what it's going to be. And then we have zeros, if I can write those up here, zeros or um, x-intercepts, solutions, whatever you want to call them. We have x equals negative 1, right there we have x equals 1, and there we have x equals 4, places where this curve is intersecting the um, x-axis. So how, does these, how do these turn into these? Well, if x equals negative 1, and we add 1 to both sides, that means that x plus 1 is equal to 0. So this is going to be the factor. x plus 1. Same thing where x is equal to 1. We subtract 1 from both sides. Get x minus 1 is equal to 0. When x is equal to 4, subtract 4 from both sides. Get x minus 4 is equal to 0. These are going to be our four factors. Or three factors, sorry. Four if you count one-fourth. And how do we deal with these squared possibilities popping up in the uh, options that we have? Well, notice that there's two types of zeros in this function. At negative 1 and 4, the value of the function changes from positive to negative or negative to positive. So it's crossing and then going through the axis. Versus at 1, it's negative, and then it hits 0, and then it goes back to being negative again. And so that's what's going to determine the powers of these three factors. If it's going through, then it's going to be an odd factor. And if it's just touching, it's going to be an even factor. So given that these are all either 1, if you can imagine an imaginary 1, or 2, for odd, fact, for odd um, powers, we're going to use 1. And for even, we're going to use 2. So it goes through at negative 1, which corresponds with x plus 1 equals to 0. So that's going to be, so it's going through, it's going to be odd power, so we're going to use 1. Again, it could be 3, 5, whatever, but since we are just trying to connect it to one of these options, we're going to stick with 1. x minus 1 corresponds with x is equal to 1, which is this one right here, where it doesn't cross through, which is it bounces off of it. So that's going to be an even, so that's going to be squared. And then x is equal to 4, corresponds with x minus 4, that crosses through, so that's just going to be a 1. And then if we get rid of the 1s, because x plus 1 to the 1 is just x plus 1, we're left with 1 fourth times x plus 1 times x minus 1 squared times x minus 4, and this corresponds with d. So that's going to be our final answer. As always, thank you for liking and subscribing, and I'll see you in the next video.